we are out and about for our first trout trip of 2022 got about 30 minutes got a beautiful pristine day here at the lake hopefully the fish are biting stay tuned all right so today we're going to keep it simple we got a jar of power bait um i also have it in a yellow color that i think will work very well big key if you're going to use power bait my suggestion buy the jars that are just solid you know dough um i'll show you really quick when you open it Oop. why i recommend these over the nuggets is you get more for your your money ounce wise and it takes you know just a second to make a ball power bait ball now what i have is a gamagatsu single egg hook um using four pound test and all i'm going to do is take this power bait and kind of feed it around the hook and really make sure that that ball is compact because you want it to be able to float if there's any like breaks or openings it's not going to float very well and i got a little split shot about 12 inches up now biggest key the fish just jumped there uh when you're fishing power bait i'm going to show you right here you want it to be able to float so i'm dropping it right now notice how it's floating now it's pretty shallow right here where i'm going to be casting might be a little bit deeper you want to make sure that's floating you don't want it on the bottom with all that vegetation because uh most of the time it's not going to end up working well for you they call it i guess the float rig and one thing you could do like right there for something as shallow as that you can adjust it by moving the split shot down like i just moved it down about six inches and now see how it's floating suspended off the bottom that's how you want it and big key once you do have your bait out there you want a little bit of slack in your line why typically these trout will grab that power bait and start to swim with it they don't sit there and and chew on it so you want to kind of give them you know one two maybe three seconds to run with it and then once they've kind of got it in their mouth and they're going that's when you want to try and set the hook but enough about the rig uh let me get packed up and we'll find a spot to fish all right one of the things i'm looking for when i'm coming to a spot to fish is a spot that doesn't have as much vegetation because that could make for a long day of fishing when you're trying to you know yet every cast you got to pull off all this Got him. You got him. Man. Finally. Yeah. Look at this guy, man. Took a minute. That's how it's done, man. Did All you right. catch him on the corner? Yeah. First one. Good. Oop. Finally got him. Good, good, man. Come on. There we go. Nice one. All right, all right, all right. On, Look at that guy. Yeah, I lost a couple of them. Oh. My son-in-law, he comes here and I showed him what to do, and he really didn't do it. And he just made up his own rules, and he left in 20 minutes. <laughs> and I'm like, dude, do you actually expect to have success when you in 20 minutes? I mean, come on, man. People in casino spend their time rolling in. There you go, bro. Got him, yeah. Rolling the dice, man. Another Yep. Power bait? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Here we go. Oh. Grabbed it and dropped it. Let's see if he comes back. Got him. Oh, good, man. Can't resist it. 